This program was brought to you by PlayStation. Hi there, and welcome to Revisit to Retro. I'm Johnny, and today we're doing the Let's Revisit on Time Crisis on the PS1. So, obviously, I'm going to have to play this with the controller because, well, the the gun, the Namco gun, doesn't work with modern telly. So we'll we'll try. I don't think that works. I think we're after going back now. See, so yeah, we'll try arcade, and we'll see how far we can do with the controller. You know what I mean, right? And then we'll try special and. So it'll be either a very quick video or a very long video. I think the former. Here we go. And we'll try story mode, then we'll try timed game. So we'll see how far we get in story first. Because like the analog six don't even work on this, you know, so it's finicky as hell. <laughs> The taste of revenge is sweet. Your father will pay the price for destroying the Imperial rule. What happened? We've been invaded. What? Never mind. My men will gun him down. That was awesome at so many levels. Alright, so here we go. So yes, Time Crisis. I think everybody knows this game. It was, uh, I think, it still is an arcade staple. I still see Time, well, Time Crisis Two anyway. I still see those machines around. Oh, okay. So Square jumps up. Eh! Accuracy out the window here. Come on. Oh, God. So, yeah, it's a bit finicky to control, but, yeah, it's grand. I, I don't know how accurate this is to the arcade version, but it still look, it looks pretty good, like, well, for me it does, anyway. Okay, red guys give me time. That's something to do. Oh! I think we're doing well. Oh god. Fix sake. There we go. Shucks. Sweet, forty-four percent. I'll take it. Do no no no. Action, danger. We're doing good. We're doing good. Hiding. 
In this stage two anyway, hopefully. I think it says shucks when you get shot. Ah! See, it's finicky because it, it jumps around like that. Stage 2, 37%. Actually, starting to dip, but I don't mind. So, yes, I, I do actually have the gun for this. It's in this box and everything. I, I looked after it. Haha, <laughs> the diving shot. One too many John Woo movies, I think. Doing well. Oh! Ah! Hit in the face of nine bar. No more lives. Yes, we'll retry. Seven credits. So. Action! Check it. This guy's he dies through the air. Ah, I locked the door. That's pretty good. Oh, there he is. Ah, oh, you fecker. You filthy fecker. This guy is... Ah, hit the fist nine bar. Yeah, you better feck up. You come back for more? No. Didn't think so. Ah. Shot him in the ankle. Oh man. I'm going as fast as I can. Ah, sugar. Alright, alright, alright. We'll go again. Let's just avoid those iron bar boys. Try to close the door again. Right. Ah! This is bollocks. My infinite supply of clips. Run your man over. Twenty seconds. Time's getting tight. Action. 
Take off the grenade, you little fecker. Come on, pop out for me. Ah! Woo! I fell off my chair there. Alright, we'll have one more go of the same area. And then we'll try the time time area. Time zone. I'm gonna shoot a door and lock it. Oh, I can't do the same. I shouldn't be losing life there. Oh, I lost two. Oh. Yeah, you better get out of here. Punks. Action. Ah, for fuck's sake. Goose for time again. Alright. Ah, shit. Ah. Forty nights. We've progressed. Oh, yeah, we did well though. How far did we get? Oh, nearly the stage two. All right, we're gonna try the remote. I thought it went rather right well, actually, considering I haven't played this game since like '97 or '90. Yeah, '97 I got this, I think. All right, so arcade again. We'll try timed game. All right, we'll try. Stage two, because we're nearly finished stage one there, so we we'll jump to stage two with unlimited lives. I like the way that the uh, the gunfire, the sound changes when you're in different locations. Like outside, it was kind of more more open because. Uh, well, it's outside, obviously, but you can hear it echoing in the in the, uh, the corridors. Bloody hell! Reload. See, I'd have been dead long ago already. Like, this isn't cheating now. This is actually a game mode, so. Pecker throwing grenades. No. There you go. Oh, the whole lot of them in there. I don't remember those. Come on. Fifteen. Not bad. Unlucky Ray.
sweet. Oh. Right on the chandelier. They love to make an entrance. Blast. Ooh. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Thirteen seconds. Oh. Time is up. Game over, yeah. Right. Does it show us how far we got there? No. Alright, so I was supposed to try Zone 3. The hard zone. Kick. Fudge. Kingdom for a bigger clip. Why is current ranking just floating there? Come on. Ah, shoot him in the back. Shoot him in the back. Ah. Bad. Action, Reload. Reload. How am I supposed to get that? Nice. Well, that was hard mode, and I don't think I'm gonna do much better than that now. It's just very finicky, right? We'll do special as well as thinking about. What's special again? I can't see. I, I didn't. Long time no see. I hope you're ready. Here's your next objective. Your mission is to uncover the plan of the organization Cantaris. This is their headquarters. The hotel is actually a front for their weapons factory. This is their leader, also known as Contaris. Intel came up empty on Contaris. We don't even know a real name or gender. However, we do have positive verification that they are Wild Dog's arms supplier. Good luck, Richard. Huh. There we go. So... Yeah. See, so yeah, I know it is quite tough playing this with the controller. It is like you're dragging it across the screen. Oh, I don't care. Fix it. Bloody hell. Action. 
Ah, shucks. That's why nobody like shoots him as he runs into the hotel. Ah, shucks. We're going well. We're going well. We're doing good. You shoot a guy in the back. I get two seconds out of run. I love it. Ah. I don't think these boys realize the benefits of actually having a gun. You can you can fire from a distance from cover. You don't have to run at me with it. It's not like a knife. Come on, get out of here. Ah, you fecker. Alright. Oh man. I tried the sweeping motion there, but uh, it didn't work for me. God damn it. Area 1, clear. Accuracy, 36%. I'll take it. Where are we going? The lobby? No, shopping mall. There we go. There we go. A lot of people now. I mean, one life left. Shucks. Gee, Williger. Ah, <laughs> shoot him in the back. Oh no, they work here. A lot of ginger lads working here. It's like one of those ginger only resorts you hear about. Or ginger festivals, I mean. That's you're the worst terrorist ever. 
Oh, come on. Oi! I didn't shoot him because he looks like there's some guy working here. Oh, no more lies. Woo, nerf off a chair again. Let's get that wheeler placed. Uh, no, we'll leave it there. Oh, no, actually. I know. I know. So, yeah, that was Time Crisis on the PlayStation 1. So, we'll go to the wrap up and we'll discuss it more there. <laughs> So yeah, that was Time Crisis. Um, it's still pretty good. I enjoyed it. Uh, it really, it's one of those games that really needs the gun. Um, you're all like, yeah, no shit, but like, at least even with like House of the Dead and Virtual Cap, you can still use the controller reasonably well. With this, it's very finicky because it doesn't trace across the screen. It jumps across the screen, so you're just jumping back and forth either side of the people trying to shoot. But no, it was still pretty good. I I did enjoy it. Now it makes me wish I still had my old CRT TV play properly but I don't so what can you do so yeah it's uh, it's grand it's fine you know it's not amazing it's not terrible it's, it's fine it's still a test of time I think so anyway uh, I didn't notice too much of a difference between this and the arcade versions like the arcade ones are supposed to be crisper and smoother but yeah it's pretty good especially for 97 so yeah we'll uh, we'll wrap up there Thanks very much for watching. If you like what you saw, why not give an old like and subscribe? Every like and subscription really helps out the channel. You can also check out the rest of our videos and I'm sure you're going to find something that you enjoy because we cover a wide variety of, of gaming types, so check it out. You can also follow me on Twitter for updates and I occasionally put up pictures of my new additions to my collection so you can check those out too. So anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye.